The beginning of love is to let those we love be perfectly themselves and not to twist them to fit our own image. Otherwise we love only the reflection of ourselves we find in them. You're welcome to my channel Zulu Queens, where you would find the beauty of African Zulu paradise. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, click on the notification icon, like, comment and share for more videos. According to Zulu culture, at the Eniokini Zulu Royal Palace each September at the Reed Dance Festival, or Amkosi Womlanga. The tradition begins with the Virgin. Maids gathering reeds from the river and bringing them to the Zulu king. The girls dance with the reeds in front of the king. There are several types of Zulu dances that occur throughout the year. And many occasions that call for a dance. Some examples of this significant time periods include weddings, childbirth and coming of age initiations. Other dancing occasions include inaugurations of Zulu kings and war victories. Types of Zulu dances There are many types of Zulu dances besides the reed dance. The Ingoma dance is considered one of the most purest forms of Zulu dance according to Zululand Eco Adventures. This dance is performed to a chant and during transition. Ceremonies, such as coming of age, weddings and pre-hunt or pre-battle time periods. The ingoma is frantically danced and incorporates high kicking motions. The Indlamu dance is the traditional male warrior dance and it shows off muscular strength and mock fighting. The Invunyolo dance only has one dancer and is done to show off traditional Zulu attire and place in society. Asikatemia is a dance performed by a group of men or boys standing in a straight line to symbolize community life and issues. At weddings, both the Ingoma and Indamu dances are done, along with Ombholoho dances. These types of dances feature both families of the newly married couple. Please don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, click on the notification icon, like, comment and share for more beautiful videos.